Hi, welcome to my channel. This is Kauser Wise and this is the continuation video of ratio analysis. So far we have seen 15 ratios under profitability and 7 ratios under turnover. You can find the playlist link in the description box. Now in this video we are going to see the remaining 3 ratios which comes under turnover ratio. Okay, see the problem. You are required to calculate the following. Number 1, working capital turnover. Number 2, capital turnover. Number 3, owned capital turnover. The information available is as under. Capital employed 5 lakhs. Within that, long term loan 1 lakh included. Then, current assets 3 lakh. Current liabilities 50,000. Sales 6 lakh. Cost of sales 5 lakh. Okay, with this information, they are asking you to find out working capital turnover, capital turnover and owned capital turnover. Now, let's see the solution. See the solution. Now, we are going to calculate the first one. That is working capital turnover. The formula is sales or cost of sales divided by net working capital. In our problem, we have sales as well as cost of sales. Okay, we are going to find out working capital turnover on sales as well as working capital turnover on cost of sales. Okay, now we need to find out working capital. How to calculate working capital? The formula is current assets minus current liabilities. Okay, now you can calculate this. The first one, working capital turnover on sales. How much sales? 6 lakh divided by net working capital. That is current assets minus current liability. So 6 lakh divided by 2,50,000 is equal to 2.4 times. In the same way, we are going to find out working capital turnover on cost of sales. So, instead of sales, we are going to consider cost of sales. See the problem. Cost of sales how much? 5 lakh. So, 5 lakh divided by working capital. How much? 2,50,000. No, 2,50,000. The answer is 2 times. Okay. Now we are going to find out the second one. What is the second one? See the problem. Capital turnover ratio. Okay. See the formula for capital turnover ratio. Sales or cost of sales divided by capital employed. Okay. So we are going to find out capital turnover ratio on sales as well as on cost of sales. Okay. See, capital employed also given in the problem. See the problem. Sales how much? 6 lakh and capital employed 5 lakh. 6 lakh sales divided by capital employed 5 lakh. Answer is 1.2 times. In the same way, we are going to find out the capital turnover ratio on cost of sales. See the problem. Cost of sales how much? 5 lakh. 5 lakh cost of sales divided by capital employed same 5 lakh. So answer is 1 time. Okay. Now we are going to find out the third one. That is see the problem. Now we are going to find out the third one. That is owned capital turnover ratio. See there is a difference between capital turnover and owned capital turnover. In capital turnover, we have taken the entire capital employed. Okay. This inclusive of long term loan. Whereas owned capital means excluding of debt. That is only equity. Shareholder fund alone will be taken into consideration. Okay. So that total capital employed minus long term loan, you will be getting equity shareholders fund. Okay. Now see the formula to find out owned capital turnover. This is the formula to find out owned capital turnover. Sales or cost of sales divided by shareholders fund. Okay. So, we are going to find out owned capital turnover on sales as well as on cost of sales. Okay. So, how to find out shareholders fund? See the problem. Capital employed 5 lakh minus long term loan 1 lakh. You will be getting shareholders fund. Okay. See the first calculation on sales. That is owned capital turnover ratio on sales is equal to sales how much? See the problem 6 lakh. 6 lakh divided by shareholders fund. 
capital employed 5 lakh minus long term loan 1 lakh. The answer is 1.5 times. In the same way, owned capital turnover ratio on cost of sales. Cost of sales how much? See the problem. Cost of sales 5 lakh. So 5 lakh divided by shareholders fund how much? 4 lakh. Answer is 1.25 times. Okay, so this is the way to calculate working capital turnover, capital turnover and owned capital turnover. Okay, in the next video we are going to see solvency ratio. You can find the playlist link in the description box. Hope you like this video. Please hit the like, comment, subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you.